This next contest is a fatal four-way. The winner of this contest gets a shot at the Great Lakes title at Summer Smash. First are you, up. Are you keeping his helmet as a trophy there? I should. really been showing great work uh, since coming here. Champion, future champion, but defeating the former champion in the Cody Leedy. He did beat Cody Leedy at Slamathon. As well as Victor Cross to make it to the finals of the Slamathon tournament. Victor is also over Pure Fury Jeff Klaus. He's really proven himself as someone to really look out for. Definitely. Up next. Guy. I'm more afraid of as a partner who we're not seeing right now. I'm actually surprised they're just getting out here. But like usually when one's here, you usually see Stitches or Jack brought far, not far behind the other. And up next. Ben Grizzly being a breakout star. Tyler Dean has been proving himself a lot this year as well. I actually had a match with him back in Blitzfield Road Church, and I tell you, he's good talent. Yeah, he was able to have, again, great victories over former Great Lakes champion Alex Crow. He had some great runnings in both the Russell Rama Battle Royal and the television title Battle Royal. Definitely a name to look out for. And the final challenger. Now here's an individual who's been really changing his ways ever since Russell Rama. I mean, we've seen him teaming with Stitches McVay and Jack Aaron in the past. However, ever since Russell Rama. <laughs> you, you really are going to keep I, that. I'm keeping that home. I think I deserve it. Ever since what happened between Stitches McVay and A. Wicked, we're seeing Wicked embracing the crowd more. And it should be interesting to note of what's going to happen between Taryn and Wicked in this battle. Well, you know those two are going to grab each other. Oh, for sure. I'm looking forward to this. Wicked just taunting with the crowd. I can say Tara is already biting at the bed. <laughs> Hope that kid gets that shirt autographed. Wicked is going to be a big star in Michigan and the rest of the world soon. I can feel it. In fact, everyone in this ring, everyone in this ring has potential to be one of the next mega stars for not only the Michigan wrestling organization, but for the entire world. Looks like a wicked <laughs> commanding the troops to get on the big man. It's really not a good sign. Uh oh, we're gonna have some air. Oh! Flipping sent time. Bam Grizzly once again now being used by 
Tyler Dean what? is a stool. Oh, man. <laughs> this is not looking good for any of these men, except maybe Bam. And here, here comes Tyler. Oh! <laughs> I hope Bam's not going to do the same thing. Not really know if Bam wanted to fly, but... He's climbing. Bam, yeah, don't do like it, man. Me wrong. <laughs> don't do it, Bam. Don't try to be one of the cool kids. I mean, he's got a lot of stuff to land on, sure, but he could easily hurt himself. He'd be from breakout star to broken star in a second. And he's going for... Oh, oh my oh. goodness! <laughs> Holy senton! Wow! I've never seen Ben Grizzly leap off the top rope, and it was effective this time. Bam throwing Tyler back into the ring. Looks like he was already dropping across, thanking God for protecting him on that flip. Oh, nice chop. Nearly flipping Tyler Dean out of his boots there. You know, these are two men that I'm really excited to see. As we were saying, two of the more breakout stars here. Nice backbreaker, neckbreaker combination there. And a standing frog splash. I was about to call it a mini frog splash. A mini, mini frog splash. We'll go with that. Sounds better. <laughs> so on the outside, Jack Terran and A. Wicked are going at it. Well, Tyler Dean dropping a low drop kick. And now, looks like he's going for a hurricanrana, but Bam is fighting it. Bam. Nope. Tyler Dean got the nice. hurricanrana on Bam Grizzly. And A. Wicked down out here. Looked like he uh, got sent into the ring post. Ring post. Yeah. Dropping the knee now across Ben Grizzly's face, losing the old glory they always has on his forehead. Now, I know Wicked really wants to try and get some sort of vengeance on Taryn and Stitches McVeigh, but Taryn might not be the person to go after right now. Another Dean. Whoa. What's that? Oh! oh. I don't know who got the worst part of that. It looked like Teledy was going to go for a jumping DDT. But Bam was able to reverse it. Kick out. Bam doing the smart thing now, rolling out of the ring. But it's never a smart thing when you're facing Tyler Dean because he's going everywhere. He will fly, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, he's about to do it right now. Well, he's looking out for oh, Jack. Change his mind. I, oh, oh, bear hog! You don't want to be there. No. Tyler Dean took too much time. He was worried about Jack and Wicked where they were, and now he's in a rough position as it is. And a big belly-to-belly -belly suplex from Jack Terran. Just a two cap. You know, one of the other things you know, Jack, Tyler Dean needs to probably worry about this match is not only that knee across his head, it's perhaps the wind as well. Just another two count. You never know if this wind's going to blow him away for some of these moves. He is light enough. <laughs> oh, we got a wicked line. He's trying to pull himself up there, but he's been getting a beating on the outside by Jack Terran. Flubbing forearms across the back. Oh, oh. He's trying to get him out of the ring. Jack's able to keep himself. He might have just wanted to fall with that kick across the face instead. It's a good way to get the big man out. And Tyler D now going at it with a wicked. Two of the highest flyers in this company next to J.J. Hughes. Reversing the clothesline now. Oh. And the go to sleep there. And Tyler Dean does look like he's dreaming. I'm going to too. Bam Grizzly's back in there, getting the crowd hyped up. And a double axe hand across the chest on the A wicket. Oh, this could be it. Nope, kick out at one. Now, you were saying that Bam Grizzly's become one of the breakout stars, but as an in ring performer, as you are yourself, how do you feel about Bam Grizzly being a guy in the Great Lakes title hunt, the television title hunt, and so on? 
you know, the way he's proved himself lately, and I, this, this is me being, you know, the wrestler, not Laura Phoenix, the bad guy, but he's just, he's got the crowd behind him, he performs in the ring, and he's just great. Oh, oh. log roll. He was going for the count, the log roll, going a signature maneuver. But now, as Laura Phoenix, the bad guy, yeah, I want to take him out at the knees. <laughs> now, are you a bad guy or a bad girl? I'm a bad person. Bad person, okay. I know our my former commentator, Bob, was calling you a dude a little bit. As we're seeing, Ben Grizzly trying to... He calls and Noah everybody Hurt around a driver there by A. Wicked. He calls everybody dude, though. It's true. Jack Terra now, he's coming back into it, climbing. We're seeing a lot of people climbing to the top rope and middle rope, but Tyler D now able to stop him. Oh. Tyler and A. Wicked trying to double team now on Jack Terran. Because that's a big man. If he's going to land on any of them, they might not be able to stand up again. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Bam. Bam. Bam, trying to show his strength here. That's three men. That's a nearly 700 pounds. Oh, my goodness. The strength of Bam Grizzly taking out all those men at once. But wasn't enough. Tyler Dean able to kick out. Now going on to A Wicked. Just barely a two count. Almost a two count, it looked like. And we are here live at Soberfest. Full crowd here. Flint, Michigan. Second year doing oh, oh, super kick! Damn Grizzly just took one right off the chin. He's got that beard that I've been able to protect him a little bit. You ever taken one of Egg Wicked's super kicks? I'd rather not. <laughs> oh, no. What are stitches doing out here? He said he I wasn't going to be too far behind him. Jack Terran's around. A Wicked's going after him. Oh! oh. Somebody's got to go find A Wicked's head because I can't see it right now. Meanwhile, Tyler Dean trying to take care of Bam. Bam. Oh. This could be done. Bam Grizzly able to pick up the victory. Meanwhile, we see Jack Terran and going in on it with Stitches McVay and Abe Wicked. Is busy today. Well, Gio, the first time was your fault. Not exactly my fault. He's the one who stabbed me. You're the one that cost him the match, but getting more focus on this. Stitches McVay will be in action later in tonight's show. Let's be going one on one with Scotty Freytown, but it seems like his problems with Abe Wicked aren't done yet. Van Grizzly, though, continuing his run, beating a fellow rookie to MWO, Tyler Dean. This kid is really exciting. We're interested to see what he could do at Summer Smash. 